guys, so this is the time that I broke my finger at a party. So, um, starts off junior year of high school. This is a, it's a Friday, it's probably the worst Friday of my life. Like, I get there late, I talk to my dean, like, you know, getting a lot of crap from my teachers. Like, I'm not doing no homework, anything. So, like, uh, it's probably, like, break or lunchtime, and my friend goes up to me, he sees that like, I'm having a pretty shitty day, and he's just like, boom, idea, let's go get fucked up tonight, like, let's go to a party. I, immediately, I'm just like, uh, I don't know if I want to go, like, you know, I just want to go home, chill, whatever. And then he's just like, how about this, if I get everyone to go, like, as a group, like, will you go? And I said, you know, if you can get every single one of us to go, like, yeah, I'll go. Like, I'm not going to miss out, like, on all, like, all my friends going to a party. So, uh, he gets, he goes to me up. He goes up to me at like after school and he's like, all right, so you're going, like we're all meeting up at my house. And I'm like, oh, okay. Like I didn't, I didn't think he was going to pull through with this, but you know, whatever. So, you know, oh, I, I thought you were asking a question. I was like, what? <laughs> so um, I go home, get ready, go to my friend's house. We're pre-gaming. And then the, Whitt the, the party's in Whittier and I don't really know the area that well. So we get dropped off. <laughs> the party said like it started at like 9.30 or whatever, we get there at like 9.15, there's like no one there, but they let us in, we're just playing beer pong, whatever, and like it's a pretty nice backyard, pretty big pool, so it took off much of, like most of the space, but pretty lengthy, and um, I'm thinking to myself like this is going to be pretty lame, like no one's here like at all, and within minutes the whole place is like packed to the point where it's like I'm walking and like I'm trying to like scoot through people, you know, slide through, because it's like you're bumping shoulders with like everyone. So the night goes on and um, like a couple fights break up but nothing too serious. And then I see this dude on the roof like with a bottle of like Jameson just stumbling like, you know, can't move. And he jumps into the pool like giant cannonball and that's when like that party just like amplified like tenfold. Like everyone just started going crazy, like breaking stuff. Like it was ridiculous. And I'm over here like, you know, like, I'm a little drunk, whatever, but like, I have a good time. And then all I see is like a giant spotlight on like, in the area, and I'm like, what the fuck is this, like, what's going on? And all I see is like a helicopter like hovering over, <laughs> and I'm like, okay, so it's time to go guys, like, it's, it's time to go. So like, it was a group of maybe 10 of us, and like, we were like split up, I was with maybe like four of my friends. And um, we go to like the right side of that backyard, you know, like trying to get out. And then all we see is like four like put like you know patrol cars outside that way. And we're like, okay, let's go to the other side. And the whole party's just bunched up like in that corner. It's like maybe a couple hundred people just bunched up in one corner. And um, there's a fence you can jump over, like still in the backyard. And um, so we start jumping the fence. I get over and I put my hand on the rail like this, but like waiting for my friends. And all I hear is a loud and like. A two by four just fucking smashed my finger, like broken. So like I look at it and I start panicking. I'm like, crap, like I have a broken finger. Like I start, you know, having a panic attack and then I realize I can't feel it. I'll feel, like I'll deal with this later. Everyone's fine. So like I'm walking, I'm walking. We get to, we get outside the house, I'm looking for my friends, but we can't find them. And then like a, one of the cops approaches me, and I'm like, okay, you're sober, you're fine, we can talk. <laughs> so, like, the officer obviously knew I was, like, really trash, so, <laughs> like, he was just, like, pretty much just said, like, get out, and I was like, you got it, you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> so I start walking down the hills or whatever, because we're in friendly hills, but, like, I didn't know that at the time. We end up at a, a Dunkin' Donuts, and then I get a call from my friends, they're like, hey, we're gonna get into this car, but we don't know if, like, person's like drunk or not so I'm like fuck we gotta get to them we get to them and then we like you know all group up finally and went to some random girl's house and got picked up from there and that was that night <laughs>